Hello, brothers and sisters. You know, I'm out here on this great, beautiful day. Did some stretching and meditating in the morning. It felt lovely. Uh, now I'm on my way to the gym. Uh, yes, sir. And I had a little bit of water. So let's see how I do in this adventure of working out and no eats until 7. I will keep y'all posted and I probably won't drop the video until later tonight to keep y'all on my journey on this fast with no water, no food, and gymming and see how I do. Let's go. So, I just finished. Um, I didn't drink water or ate. Um, I'm feeling a little lightheaded. Um, other than that, I'm still alive and breathing, so I guess that's good. Um, yeah, so I think it is possible to do all these things and not die. It's just you're probably not gonna feel your best, but I think I'll feel better later. So uh, I'll keep y'all in tune and, and let y'all know if anything else different happens. I don't know what he's saying, but of course, after my excellencies of working out without food and water, I had to further get tested with my brain knowledge because I love to get my brain tested. My tire blew up. Hey! But I'm not gonna lie, I hit a big ass pothole. So that's probably it. But luckily, I was in my, I was on a highway. But luckily I was able to drive it to this place and it's a tire place and they're gonna change it for me. So I'm just gonna get my tires fix so i just want to say even though bad shit happens you still can find the solution and it's not a big deal because that's honestly not a big deal it just sucks but i'm here soaking sun i'm so thankful to jesus and god i'm still fasting because i'm the goat and i would not let any pathetic evilness come in my way and and I see the double working. I see him working. Look at that McDonald's right there. I see him working. He want me to have McDonald's. I don't eat that shit, bro. No matter how hungry I am right now or thirsty, I'm not going there. Fuck you, McDonald's. Get my tire done. Take my ass home. Be with the kids and shit. You heard? Be great and blessed, y'all. This is nothing. Don't be tempted. Lead away from temptation. Temptation is bad. I believe the devil was trying to tempt Jesus a lot. And he took him up to like a, like a mountain in Matthew. In the verse of Matthew, he took him to a mountain and he showed him all the kingdoms. And he said, this can be all yours. And he was like, nah, I don't want what you trying to give me, bum ass devil. I'm good. That's how I feel. I'm not Jesus, nor do I ever feel like I can compare to him. He is too great and amazing, but we can all lead away from temptation. 
love and blessings. Primo, yo te puedo filmar haciendo esto. Sí. ¿Cómo se llama este sitio? ¿Ah? ¿Cómo se llama este sitio? Eh... Oh, ok, ok. Está mal, está mal. Ah, malísimo. <ríe> malísimo está eso. <ríe> As you can see, my man's right here just got the new tire. Didn't take too long. In about five minutes, man's out here in Patterson. Work quickly and swiftly. Mm. Yeah. Got the job done. It's looking all right. Nothing too crazy. Now see, I can be bugging out about simple fixed things. Now it's new. Now I'm happier. I'm not gonna lie, brothers and sisters. I was feeling kind of, not down, but very drained. Um, after the gym, very drained, no energy. And then once my tire popped, it was like a sense of burstness that came in me. And then once um, it got fixed, I got more happier. So maybe it'll happen to, you know, boost my adrenaline and make me, you know, more active. So I'm enjoying this very swelly. My lips dry as hell. Staying up three lanes. Order soon, soon, soon. But I can't until seven. And that's not until like another six hours. And I have to go to work. Great. That's alright. I'll bring little snacks and I won't make it until like seven o'clock. So it'll hold me down. But keep going. Never stop!